Hey guys, it's Ashley Graham and welcome to Thank Bod. We often forget how powerful our bodies are. I remind myself by hitting the gym. So come be my workout buddy and get ready to thank Bod. Engaging the core. Today we're gonna meet our abs. Yep, that's right, our abs. Maybe you already know yours, so maybe this is more of like a reintroduction. Or you could be like me and they're somewhere under there beyond a child. You'll be feeling that core in just a few seconds. So let's go. So we're gonna start with a plank and I'm gonna go into modified because I am pregnant. But even if you're not pregnant and you wanna do modified with me, come on and join me. Otherwise, I wouldn't be on my knees. But we're gonna start on our hands. It's a little bit harder than being on your elbows. So, come out, draw your navel in, tuck your butt, squeeze the fire out of it because that's how we get it. Juicy, juicy, yes. We did our front plank, now we're gonna do our side plank. I personally hate these, so at home, if you hate these too, it's okay, we're in this together. So 30 seconds on each side, I'm putting my knee under me as a modification because it's just a little bit too hard with pregnancy. Make sure your arms are lined up. Hold it out for 30 seconds. Feel the burn, and if you can't feel the burn, lift a leg for the last 10 seconds. You got this. I'm shaking if you can't see it. <sighs> Here we go. Okay, we're on the other side. Make sure your knees are lined up. That's something that's very important that I always forget to do. Make sure you're pushing your hips forward. I just started sweating. And if you didn't just start sweating at home either, you should lift a leg because now you're really gonna start sweating. Oh, and you might get a cramp in your hamstring. Breathe through it. 30 seconds. We can do this. We can do it! We're still working our core out and we are going into the bird dog crunch. So, get on your hands and knees. And we're gonna do opposite hand and opposite leg. And make sure when you extend your leg, you're flexing your booty. Again, even though we're working out the core, we're still flexing the butt. It's an opposite hand. You hold for two seconds. Bring it in. Bring it out. Now make sure your hips stay square, your back is flat. And again, two seconds. 10 times on each side. And if you can't, don't get discouraged. It doesn't matter. Let's go to the next side. The bird dog. So now we're gonna do one of my absolute favorite core workouts. And I like this one because instead of doing crunches, because mama can't do crunches anymore. So instead, voila, I have my band. Make sure you have a band secured to something really strong. It's very stretchy, lots of resistance. We have a handle. And what you're gonna do 20 to 15 times is literally pull your navel in, push your butt cheeks together. And when I say push, I mean crunch your butt cheeks together like you're gonna break open a nutcracker. And then you're just gonna push your hands out. Whew. Now make sure you're engaging your core. It's important, even when you're pregnant, to engage your core. And I don't know how people talk through their workouts when they're actually doing this, but I know it's important. And make sure that you're taking a little pause every time you come out. Let's go to the next side. All right, I flip to the next side. I've engaged my band, the resistance. I pulled in my navel, I've engaged my butt cheeks. And remember, every time you pull your arms out, you're holding it for just a couple seconds. We got 20, let's go. This is gonna get your heart rate up. It's gonna get your core going strong. And from everything that I hear about giving birth, you definitely need to know where your core is and how to engage it for the push. So this is really great for those new mommies out there who are about to push your little kid out. All right, grab your two and a half pound weight because now we're doing the side bend crunch. Ow! All right, so 
I'm gonna start on my right side, and you two can start on your right side, unless you wanna start on your left, and then we can mirror each other. I always find that very complicated when I'm doing a workout video. So, what you're gonna do is bend all the way over, and make sure that bottom toe is on its tippy toe. And this is really good for balance as well. Come up, elbow to knee, boom. This is like a side crunch. Hello, Hourglass. Is that you that I see? <sighs> Get that left foot up. Bring that left side over. And let's crunch. Woo! Bend. Yes! Hourglass. Hello. Make it even. That's right. <sighs> Why do people sing in workout videos? Or is it just me? All right, now we're gonna do Akira Stokes Special Standing Tabletop Resistance. Okay, so usually I would do these if I wasn't pregnant laying on my back, but today, since I'm quite pregnant, and maybe some of you at home are as well, we're gonna do it standing. So what you're gonna do is balance on one foot or the other. I don't care which one you do at home. And you're gonna push your quad into your hand and you're gonna engage your core because that's what the series is about, engaging your core. Flex your arms, push down your quad. Make sure you do 10 seconds on each leg. <laughs> Balance time. Make sure you're squeezing the butt cheek of the leg that you're standing on because the butt and the core are connected. All right, everybody, great work. Don't forget to grab some water, some fresh air, and most importantly, to thank your beautiful body. For more Thank Bod, subscribe below.